Hey guys, so tonight uh, I've taken a request from M. Parsons um, to cook for you guys. So last night you saw me cooking for Janae. No, you saw Janae cooking. Janae is a good cook. If you're watching this to get a good cooking show, I'll change the channel because I am a disaster chef. So firstly, just know that I've decided to film this video tonight on a balancing board because I have really bad balance. So as you can see, this is my balancing board and I plan on cooking the whole meal on my balancing board. Though, if I, if I find that I'm falling off the balancing board too much while cooking, I will stop being on the balancing board because I have really bad balance and I thought, why not improve my balance while, while I cook? So, Tonight I am cooking for you guys a recipe that has been given to me from Jenny at work. It's zucchini lasagna um, and that's all the stuff to cozy it. I don't know what it is. It's like pork, mince, beef, mince, cotter, all your other things. And there's meant to be carrot, but Janae forgot to buy it. No, no, no. Janae bought it, but she, we ate it. I didn't eat it. I don't like carrot. I, I did eat the carrot. Okay, I also, I'm falling over on my balancing board, so I don't know if this balancing board thing's gonna last. Um, I also went to the shops today and got myself a little tripod. I'm putting this in a tripod now. A tripod so I can film myself um, on the tripod for you guys. All right, so I can't show you how to make the chocolate balls now, but next time I, I, I'll do another video for you, Jay, to show you how to make the chocolate balls. It'd be really cool if you guys do ask me questions as I do this. Um, it can be questions about anything. Craig, I've been thinking about the meaning of life. <laughs> I know, it'll be very dangerous to the balancing board, but life's more fun when you're living on the edge. Um, Craig, I thought the other day about how you asked the meaning of life, and I've decided that the meaning of life is whatever you decide to make it. I think you create your own meaning to life. All right. This is going to be a really long video, so you can grab a cup of tea or come back and watch it later because I will make it onto a YouTube thing anyway. So I have got the ingredients out and now I have to read the method. I'm very literal. It's telling me to heat the oil in a large saucepan over medium heat and cook onion, carrot, celery and garlic for a few minutes. So I think that means that I have to, I'm getting off this balancing board. I'm bringing this back so you can actually see me properly cooking. There we go. There we go. Hey. Um, I have to cook, cut the stuff first. So Janae has sharpened a knife for me. Really, really dangerous. Um, I recently changed medication and it seems to be making me more hyperactive than usual. I don't know if it's making my anxiety heightened, which is making me more hyperactive, but I like have no memory. I'm really clumsy at the moment and I feel like I'm in a bit of another world. So I don't know if a really sharp, <laughs> really sharp knife is a good idea. This could end up being disaster chef turns, medical emergency, whatever. So when it says cook an onion, I guess that means a whole onion. I don't know, they're not specific. They haven't told me how much of an onion. So if anyone tells me, can tell me how I should cut an onion better, because I know I'm not very good at cutting onions. I fed the kids. Um, they jump up on the table. This is called Mr. Blue, and when Quirky jumps up on the table, he knows that Mr. Blue tells him to get back down. So I have to peel the skin. Ask me questions, guys. Give me something to talk about while I do this. It's just been really boring because it's going to be me just cutting onions. I won't be the only one crying if that's all we're watching. But I'm bomb. So I think you cut it in the middle like that, and then you go. bit thick. Janaea does this really, really quickly. Janaea was a cook for many years and what I'm making tonight, she'd probably be able to make in about 10 minutes. So that's why she tends to do the cooking, even though she doesn't like doing the cooking all the time and she gets really annoyed about it. Um, I'm just going to say it's so lucky I hopped off this wobbly board. I'm going to try cut the other half of the onion on the wobbly board. Do you know you can't hear me? Oh. Okay. 
You can't even see. Oh, I'm falling. Oh, that's better, isn't it? So I'm on the wobbly board. Vanessa will be really proud because she thinks I need to improve my balance. And what better way to improve your balance is then to cut onions on wobbly boards. All right, so now I've done that. Quirky, hop down. Quirky. We might see Quirky in the um, film soon. I guess you just go like that. Is that right? Can someone help me? Someone... I'm not getting much um, interaction tonight from you guys and... They're not... There's people watching. There's four. There's been more. I don't know who's still there though. It doesn't seem to be accurate. Like it kind of lags a bit. I don't really know but anyway. I'm not even crying. I'm pretty tough. See as you can see I'm cutting onions here really nice. Thanks Em. Someone's giving me some positive feedback. Maybe, um, um, I was thinking that for the talent show, we could have me giving a makeup tutorial to the, everyone for the talent show. Um, thanks, Trace. Yours apostrophe, why are you apostrophe R-E? Um, I think that, as I was saying, this might be, oh, shit. Now I'm crying. Oh. The onions are in my eyes. Janaya? Yeah. Can you give me a plastic bag for the rubbish, please? Because I can't walk away from this as I do it. Um, oh, so Emma was saying that I could do... Oh, shit. This hurts. Yeah, live Facebook for talent show. I can do a makeup tutorial. Like last night. What do you reckon? Janaya's just getting... I don't like it when Janaya watches me cook because I feel that she judges me. I judge me too. Um, how good is my balance? I'm working. Um, okay, so I'm nearly finished cutting up the onions. And I haven't chopped one of my fingers off yet. Put goggles, googles on. What's a google? How do I put a google on? I think she meant to say goggles. Put googles on. <laughs> hey, I'm wearing a google. Alright. Do what, Jack? Cut my finger off. I've already got a bung finger. I've already got this one. Is um, I said last night, I jarred that playing basketball with Jaden, and him being a typical kid was like, "Ooh, just keep playing then." Okay, so the onions are cut. I have to go to the next part of the recipe now. Um, cook onion. Makeup show. Cook onion, carrot. We don't have the carrot because get into the garlic. What do you mean get into the garlic? I have um. What do you mean get into the garlic? I don't understand what you mean by that. You can't. How do you get into garlic? Oh, I'm jumping into the garlic. I have this garlic granules, but I've also got minced garlic. I don't know which one's better to use. Did I ask? Is it minced garlic I should use or garlic granules? Move on to the garlic. Janaya says to get the minced garlic. Sorry about that bling. Jamie Foxx is um, asking me stuff about tutoring. No, I'm not cutting up the garlic because <laughs> that's too complicated. Um, I'm off my wobbly board now, guys, if you see better balance. So I said that I have to cut up... Um, Carrot, we don't have any. It says celery. The thing is, one celery stalk. So I don't know, like, if it's a big celery stalk or a little celery stalk. So I'll just cut up, I don't know, like, do you reckon that three of these makes one celery stalk? I don't, I don't know. So I'll just cut three of them. I really, um, I don't like it when... Oh my god, look at me go. I'm like her own, her own I'm like your Nigella Lawson. Um, it says finely cut though, I don't know if that means thinner. Oh shit, it's going over the table. I was saying something. Okay, so as I said, I hate it when recipes, they're not, um, they're not specific. So I'm, when I make my balls, that Jade was talking about the other day, I mean before, sorry, it said a splash of water. Now, so is it abomination. So is your love life, Carly, so let's just leave it at that. Um, 
<laughs> oh, boom. Sorry, that was a really good comeback. Um, what was I saying? Oh, no, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, the thing said to put in um, a splash of water. What is a splash of water? Like, I don't know. Is it a big splash, a little splash? Oh. It, I don't know. Anyway, splash of water, I find that really um, ambiguous. I don't... I need a bit more clarification as to what a splash of water is. Okay, and now I'm on to the last bit of celery to chop. As you can see, I'm chopping my celery. Next, we have to... Can someone ask me just random questions about anything? Just so we can have a bit of a conversation. If anyone's got anything they want to know, I've got good knowledge about music and Nintendo and that's about it. Um, okay, so I've cut up the celery and the heat, heat oil in a large saucepan over medium heat and cook onion, sing a song. What song? And cook onion, carrot, celery and garlic for a few minutes until softened. Turn heat and add minces and... Willow, you never get up on the table. Down you pop, baby girl. Boom. Here's Willow. I'm going to have to wash my hands now, everyone. I understand that I have to wash my hands. Stop judging me. Shh. I'm not going to wash my hands. I just want Janaya to think that I'm going to wash my hands after picking up the cat. But I'm not going to because we kiss the cats all the time. So I don't see what difference it makes if we eat food. Well, I've been touching them, okay? Don't tell Janaya. She can find this out later. Um, anyway, as I was saying, <laughs> we're singing a song. Ah, so I'll just bring you over to the uh where i'm gonna be cooking the meat on my um how's that how, how can we see there oh that's good it's good it's good sweet just give me i'm just gonna get my kitty mile i'm gonna get the mince all right got the minced garlic so it says i have to put do the oil um i'll put the light on here so, I don't know like how hot I do this or what, I'll just do it until something cooks. I've never, um, I've never cooked uh, celery, I don't know how much oil to use. I feel like uh, you, everyone's going to be judging me, because Carly's already called my um, celery an abomination. But as I said, there's other things in my life that <laughs> may be a bit more of an abomination than eating celery. So I was just taking my jumper off guys, it's getting a bit... It's getting a bit hot in here. What are you making? I'm making zucchini lasagna, Carly. I got the recipe from, um... Oh, there we go. I got the recipe from Jenny, from work. So, now we just boil the oil. Oh, that rhymes, boil the oil. Hey, that could be my song, Jack. Boil in the oil. What, what else wants with oil? Not using foil. Hanging out with Nah, I can't I can't get that rhyming anymore. Yo, Jack, wiggity whack, I got a song. Did you wanna sing back? Boil in the oil. Okay, so I'm gonna put in now the onion. It seems like an awful lot of onion. And you know, um Jaden doesn't eat onion, so thanks Jack, toil. Oh, I know, I can be like um I'm going to do something else that's really unhygienic. I'm just going to take off my tape because ah, shivers because it's falling off as I cook. Um, it's another thing. Don't tell Janae about that either. Yeah, I can do like bubble and boil like um, Shakespeare, Toil, you know, um, from Macbeth. Is it Macbeth that has the three witches? Yeah, Macbeth. Okay, so I'm just frying the onion now um, to a nice... I guess brown colour, I guess, is that what you do? You fry it to a brown colour. All right, and I'm gonna put garlic in. I don't know how much garlic I'm meant to put in. Hey, I'll get on the wobbly board while I do this, because it's, so, um, it's not so difficult. So, this is my wobbly board for those who've joined in um, a bit late. I was gonna try and cook the whole meal on the wobbly board to improve my balance, but that lasted a whole, 
I don't know, 10 seconds. So we're back on the wobbly board now. So we're just gonna improve our balance. I'm really bad at doing um, lunges and because my balance is terrible. So I bought this wobbly board from Kmart. Um, I think it was like $8 or something. $8 from Kmart for a wobbly board. And I'm getting better at it, at my balance. Andrew, Andrew, you, Andrew Burns online everyone. Andrew, okay, I've just got two of the best cooks I know have jumped online, Andrew and Sarah. So remember I said before how I'm feeling judged? Now I'm really feeling judged. Sarah, I don't know how much garlic you put into things, so I'm putting in a teaspoon. Is that all right? It's just, it's in, it's in. When I was younger, I cooked a, um, a cake. And, hi Jaden. Oh Jaden, you haven't got your new hairstyle going anymore. Oh, I changed it halfway through to Oh, did the girl you like, the girl you like, you met up with, doesn't she like the hairstyle? She must have no, liked it. No, I just it. changed it before. I'm telling them a story, mate. Um, are you trying to keep vampires away? I'm trying to keep girls away from Jaden, so technically, yeah, I'm trying to keep vampires away. Um, ah. Anyway, I was telling the story. Jaden, I'm telling the story. You've interrupted my story. When I was younger... What's for dinner? What I'm making. Yeah, Where's JT? Oh, no, I think I'm... Oh, we bought special stuff, you guys. Um, Ooh. Anyway, I'm a bit busy, Jaden. I'm busy. Um, when I was younger, I cooked um, cake, and I had really, really long, luscious, blonde locks. There's no one else to describe them. I was beautiful. I know, right? I still am. You're thinking. You're still beautiful. Because you all watched my, uh, well, some of you have watched my video from last night where it does highlight my beauty. Anyway, I had these really long, long, long locks. My hair was up to about here. And as I was cooking, I had the beaters going. You guys know where this story is going, right? It's really obvious. As I was cooking, I had the beaters going. And my I bent down and my hair got caught in the beaters and my mum said, told me to turn the beaters off so I put them up to the full speed and we had to cut all my hair off and the family ate the cake so that's, that's how good of a cook I am I have a whole lot of disaster stories from my childhood there was another time when we went fishing and I've only been fishing once it's probably the only time I've been fishing this is how it's looking, by the way, for anyone who wants to actually know what I'm cooking. Um, yeah, when we went, we went fishing when I was younger, and I was standing behind... Oh, shit. I just dropped some mints on the ground. I'll chuck it in the... I'll chuck it over there. I was standing behind my sister, who, you can probably work it out, uh, cast the fishing hook right back into my eye. So, I actually now... I'm sorry, Janae is trying to get something out of the oven. That's why I'm like bending over like you can see her. There she is. Hey, hey babe. Hey babe. She doesn't like being on camera. Um, so I've got pork mince, by the way, for anyone who's asking. Pork mince, she, I just dropped all the, all the juices in there. Pork mince and the rest is in the regular mince. If you want to make it healthier, you should probably get um, grass-fed mince. Or for you veg vegetarians out there, just get your... Um, fake mince that you use. Okay, so yeah, my other story being that Rhiannon, my middle sister, she cast the, she cast the fishing hook um, and it went straight into my eye. That's another childhood, I'd say tragedy, but let's be honest, there's probably some worse tragedies than that one. Um, childhood events. Uh, there was another time when I was really cute. Still am, um, but I was really cute. I was the youngest, and people used to always comment how cute I was. So I'm not even just saying this. So I was, I was cute. You wait till I have a, when there's a baby in my belly, and that comes out. You'll see how cute I am. And ah, uh, work. Oh, I don't even know what I'm saying. See, I told you this medication's making me crazy. Um, yeah, and I was like, I was lying on the concrete, just relaxing, and. My sister, Rhiannon, the middle one, the one who got the fish hook in my eye, she told me to move. I'm not going to move, right? I'm there first. She's on her bike. She was, she was a bit bigger than me. I was, I was a bit of a little one. And so she proceeds to ride over me on the bike. I got concussion. The doctor had to come to the house. And that's another childhood 
injury. My third childhood injury that I can tell you about, so I've got the hair in the beaters, I've got my sister running over me on the bike. The third one would probably be when uh, my dad, okay, this is a, those who are at my 30th, they'll know this story, because it's um, one that we, we still dispute what colour the bike was, but anyway, we didn't have that much money growing up, so my dad, instead of getting me a new bike for my, I've just put in the mints by the way, the other mints, my dad, instead of getting me a new bike for my birthday, he did one up, so he paint, spray painted it, um, put stickers on it, and honestly today, I, it is, I think, one of the nicest things anyone's ever done for me. So like you know when you when you're a kid you don't appreciate it so much you kind of want the new things um, but I think as you get a lot older you start to really appreciate those kind of things people do for you so you know one of the one of my favourite present Sorry. growing up Jayden. Sorry Jaden Jaden forgets that I'm now making videos and that he has to not talk to them um, one of my favourite gifts growing up yeah was the bike my dad gave me anyway I think being a second hand bike though it wasn't as good as some other bikes may have been. And as I was riding it with my sister, Alicia, she's my eldest sister, it split in half, straight in the middle. And I ended up on one half of the bike, on the floor, and the other half was split. We're still spreading the word that you're live. This may take a moment. Oh, thanks, Facebook. Delayed reaction. It's only, what, 20 minutes into my video and they're spreading the word. Anyway, so, my mince is just about cooked, so then I'll be able to go back to the finishing of the lasagna. I will, uh, I know some people have wanted finished products, so I will um, I will show you a finished product once it's done. So, no one's been asking me any questions. Jack's asked me to sing a song, I sang a song, told you about... Okay, you're going to see something really cute in a second. Here's Quirky. Quirky, I think, wants to eat the mints. Quirk, what are you doing, buddy? Okay. I'm just going to get Quirk to bring Quirky down now because Quirky wants to be in the video or he wants to eat the mints. I think he wants to eat the mints. Yeah, and you're not going to be eating until dinner time. No, you've chosen, put that away, you've chosen to not come home at all since 11 o'clock. No, put it back in there, you're not to eat till dinner. You've chosen not to come home at all for lunch, you've chosen to not eat all day. So you're not to eat now before dinner. Sorry guys, parenting. Um, and also I found four bits of cooked toast in there. Which I don't know why you've cooked it and then put it back in there. Sorry guys. Jaden's been out all day and hasn't come home for lunch and then he's gone to cook but he has to wait till dinner time because as you can see I'm cooking up a smorgasbord for him. Alright so the, min the mince is cooked now so I'll take this back over to where we were. Um, as you can see the mince, the mince is cooked, we've got the pork mince and we've got the other mints, uh, the normal mints, it's a bit, um, it's a bit, shall we say, moist. <laughs> uh, anyway, and, oh, it's really heavy. I think I'm going to drop it. Um, I'm trying to hold this and that, and I've got a jarred finger. Okay. All right, so we're back over here now. Haha, -ha, M's cooking show. I know. Disaster chef, it's called. Um... So, I stir through, oh no guys, well, I wasn't meant to take it off yet, I have to put other stuff in there, I just read the recipe again. Um, turn heat to high and cook minces and thyme and continue to cook, baking up plants for five minutes, season with salt and pepper. So right, let's just come back here, I've got to turn this back on. Okay, so it's back on. We'll just turn that back on, we'll see, oh, it never happened, it never we never turned it off and went over there. So I have to put the thyme and I have to put these in it. Um, Janaea went to get me thyme. I'm not sure what it is. This ended up on the um, the table, so I guess that it's thyme. I don't know if I meant to put in the... Like, do I just put it in like that? I don't know. I'll just break it up a bit. 
I think I should probably turn this down a bit as well. Just chuck the time in. Rosemary and time, remember me who said once again. Cause he was a true love of mine. Okay, now I've got to put this stuff in. This is Italian passata. Just mix that through. Oh, whoops, I was meant to put salt and pepper in before that. I've done it in the wrong order. I don't think it matters. Um, Chanel Sarah was watching me before, me before and I think she's judging me. Because she's a really good cook. And she asked if I'm trying to scare vampires away. So I think she means that I've used too much garlic. So if anyone sees me tomorrow, I'm sorry. If anyone's doing um, VK time fit class in the morning and uh, <laughs> someone stinks, it's me. Just putting it out there. I stink. Oh shit, it's got pepper in my eye. Oh, that hurts. Last night I got soap in my eye when I was doing my makeover. People like my makeover too. I don't know if that means that you guys think I should femme up a little bit or you just thought I was like an idiot. I don't know. Anywho. So, mix that in. Now I have to mix these in. Um, this is diced tomatoes. Ow, shit, that hurt. That's my um, injured finger. I can see I've got bruising. Can you see that finger there? This one. This one here. It's bruised. And it's like... You can't see. I'm putting the wrong finger up. Anyway, it's sore. But I went to the gym this morning. I was meant to be there. Oh, shivers. All right. Mixing this through. So now we've got... A nice bolognese sauce. Oh. And we've also got pepper in my eye. So let's go back to the menu, to the recipe again. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to keep this on or if I'm supposed to turn it off. So I'll just keep it on for now until I work it out what the hell it is that I'm doing next. So I'm just going back over here. Now it says brush. A rect I've got to sneeze. I think it's the um I think it's the pepper. Why have I got nutmeg? Wait, wait. wait. Nutmeg is somewhere in this recipe that I was meant to put in somewhere. Oh no, I mix it together in a bowl, it's alright. Um Okay, so stir through done that, preheat oven and brush a regular okay. So that's that. I have oil. Yeah. Um, I don't have a brush, so I'm just going to use this. The thing is, you can always make do with something else. Um, we know last night when I didn't have any eyebrow um, pencil, we made do with eyeliner. Um, when I didn't have the correct makeup removal, we used olive oil, which... I just don't get why I don't use baking paper, though. Like... Won't it not stick to the baking paper? I find that if I use um, oil, it might stick. Sometimes I, I, I cook and I follow the instructions and I do all the right things and things don't work out for me. Oh, it's a bit tragic, isn't it? How sad is that? I need, like, I need the world's smallest violin right, as I say that. Well, it's just so hard for me. Okay, so I've done that. Brushed a regular oven-proof dish with oil in a bowl. Combine ricotta, egg, and nutmeg and mix together until smooth. All right, so we've got a bowl here. So we're combining an egg. I'm finding eggs really hard to crack at the moment because my finger, but oh, got an egg. Um, this is the ricotta. I think I don't know if that's the right amount. I'll just chuck it all in. We'll see what happens. I've got to combine the egg and with the ricotta. <laughs> it's just, it's gone it's gone in like that like how does that i don't know anyway and the nutmeg i needed half a teaspoon of ground nutmeg i'm just going to guess how much half a teaspoon is once um i was cooking spaghetti do you reckon that's half a teaspoon oh well never had nutmeg probably have once i was cooking spaghetti and the lid came off with the salt and the whole thing was assaulted get it 
<laughs> oh, jeez. Um, okay, so I need a mixer. We'll just we'll mix it with this. It's not working. Um, I don't understand how to do this. Am I meant to? Am I meant to use my hands? As if you could see what's happening here, I'm meant to be mixing this, but I don't understand because it's like it's really hard and it's it's going everywhere. And it doesn't seem to be mixing, and maybe I've put too much ricotta in. Nice pun. How much ricotta? 400 grams. How much was that? Um. I can't find the sticker that says how much it was. Yeah. I feel like there's maybe too much ricotta in here. Use your hands. Oh, but that means I... Oh, oh wait. Okay. Oh, I just patted the cats with my hands. I know, I've now <laughs> put it in. <laughs> this feels really gross. Thanks, thanks, Briley, for that tip. Because I would have known what to do. Alright, so I'm using... Oh, shit, just fell on the table. Shh, don't tell anyone. You guys are never... No one is ever going to eat any food that I cook now that they see how hygienic I am with this. I did wash my hands before I started, though, because I went to the toilet before, and I have to wash my hands after I go to the toilet. But sometimes I forget. <laughs> but don't tell anyone. Shh. Can you see Quirky in the corner there, in the back, walking over near the sink? He wants to be part of the action. Alright, so that's all um, mixed in. Now I'm going to have to wash my hands. That's annoying. I just, there's some things I just hate doing. Like, they're just such time wasters. Like, getting petrol. It's such a time waster. What a buzzkill. Going to the toilet. You know? There's much better things I could be doing, like making Facebook videos for you guys. Alright, so... Now my hands are gross, so I'm just going to wash them really quickly. Oh shit, Quirky out! I think Quirky's trying to eat the, um, the food. I've got to get Quirky out because he's about to try and, he's trying to eat the food. Quirky! Buddy! No! Out! I'm just going to bin all this stuff because he's trying to eat it. Alright, so what have we done now? Combine ricotta, egg mix. Okay, I've done that. Cover the base of the dish with a third of the zucchini. The thing is, I haven't sliced the zucchini yet. Quirky, hop down, buddy. Mate, Mr. Blue's going to come out. Quirky, you're not to go near a hot stock. I'm putting Quirky in with you guys. Sorry, I was really worried that Quirky was going to burn himself, and I love him so much. Okay. So I need to like do the um, the zucchinis in like things. So we have a thing in my that does that. I think that it's time to get back onto my wobbling board. Um, okay, this is where the fun's gonna happen. So we've got we've got one of these things, but I don't know which one I'm meant to use. So I'll show you the options. <laughs> And if someone could tell me which one I'm meant to use, that would help. So I've got this, um, that, that, no, maybe it's just like that. I just, I'll just try it like that. I'll just try it like that because that seems like it's going to work. So I cut that. We'll see what happens. I'm on the wobbly board though again. Oh, they're a bit thick. How do I make them thinner? Can someone help? Babe! I have to call for help. Babe! Could you please help me for a second? I'm really sorry. I'm trying to do this all by myself. But I can't. use this, it ends up too thick. Well, you've probably got a big colour, put it in. Well, how do I change it? You turn it over. Oh, this, no, this, see? Thin, thick, so put it in that way. Janaya to the rescue! 
Everyone say thanks, Janelle. Thanks, Janelle. All right, so I'm slicing my zucchini. Oh, shit. I feel like I'm going to need to drain the zucchini because when you, um, when you use zucchini, you don't drain it. It's, everything ends up really soaked. Okay, so slicing. I think this is called like, ow! Oh, shit! Guys, I... I I, I sliced my finger. I sliced my finger. <laughs> I sliced my finger on the thingy. I get a band aid. This is why I don't cook. Okay, it's okay, guys. I get a band aid. Maybe that's um people minging asking me to to sponsor me for, for making such good videos. Oh shit. There's um there's a bit of blood on that, so I'll throw that one away. And I just. Okay, um, I think it's bleeding quite heavily, so <laughs> I just sliced my finger, bro. Did you just see that? Um, <laughs> shit. I've got to stop swearing. I've got to stop swearing on these things. I don't want to. Um, I want these to be PG rated. I don't want um, it to be inappropriate anyway, so I might have to edit out the swearing. <sighs> okay, so I'm just being really careful now not to slice my finger again. Shit, I just did it again. I just saw I just did it again. I've sliced two fingers now. How do you how do you do this without slicing a finger? There must be a way. Where there's a will. I'm gonna go like that and just hope for the best because I don't want to slice a finger again. I see why you call it the finger slicer, Riley. I have sliced two fingers. It hurts. It's still bleeding. It's still bleeding. Look at that. It's still bleeding. Ah. Use a fork to stop my finger. Oh, hold the thing in a fork. So, oh, we've got. I just remembered what we've got. Wait a second. We've got this. <laughs> We've got this. This is why. This is why. This is why we call this disaster chef. Uh, so this time, this time I'll do it properly. <laughs> I won't slice a finger. Okay. So let's try this again. All right. So let's try it now. Um, it. It doesn't, it doesn't stay. Ah, this really hurts. I might need to get a band-aid. doesn't, look, look at this. It doesn't, it doesn't stay. I'll get a fork. Fork in hell. Okay. I'm just going to get a band-aid. Good to see that Janae Essex hasn't gone live yet, so she's not watching this. Um, okay, so there's some band-aids in here. I'm just going to um, band-aid this up. Slice a piece of sew it flat. No, oh, that sounds complicated. Okay, so I'm just going to... Um, still bleeding. Oh shit, that's still cooking. I forgot all about that. Oh shit, that's just... Guys, there's too much going on. This is bleeding. That's cooking. I forgot all about it. I haven't finished this. I can't... I can't adult. I just can't adult. Okay, so let's... Look, we're going to band-aiding this up. And we're just going to fix it up. It's like it never happened. If you can't see it, it didn't happen. Okay. Let's go back to this um, magic... Slice a piece. Oh, I see. So she wants me to cut it so it's flat. Oh, I see. For the mach for that thingy. So if I got that, and then I go like that. Is that what you mean? Just 
still not sticking. I'm just going to go with the fork. I can't do it. It's too hard. When did, when did cooking get so complicated? I just go like this. I'm using my hand again. I can't do this. There we go. It's not, it's not working. Guys, can somebody come around and help? Um, I'll give you my address. Private message me. I'll give you my address. I might need, I'm just going to have to use my hands again and just hope for the best. I'm really just hoping for the best because it's just, it's just not working out for me. You know, when I said this was going to be Disaster Chef, I didn't actually mean it. I was like, oh, it's funny, Disaster Chef. Really is Disaster Chef. Okay. Is everyone freaking out watching me do this, like seeing my hands and going, oh my God, it's she's going to slice it? Because... I was like, nah, we're all right, and then I wasn't. I might try this one now, okay? I just don't get why it just... Just like that. Just go like that. Is that all right? Okay. Let's go again. Okay. Um, I don't know if that might be enough zucchini for now, so what I'm going to do is, what we do with the zucchini, just try and drain a bit of um, liquid from it, because it ends up really moist, and it, I find that it makes the, um, oh shit, I've got blood on my hand, I better wash it. Don't tell anyone that's eating this that I've done any of this, okay? It's our little secret. No one's going to know that I've been bleeding and that I've been patting the cats. And I promise I, if any of you guys come around for dinner that I won't let this happen. I'll, I won't. What naughty word did I say? Cat? Oh, the M word. I don't think it's a... I don't know. So I'm just... Um, Janaea says that to get um, the liquid out of zucchini you use salt so you assault them so i'm just going to do that because janae is clever when it comes to cooking now she's clever and so i'll just give that a shot so if you can see i've got um the strips of zucchini here um, i haven't got enough room Why'd you have to go and make... Um, I think there's a bit of blood on it. I'll just wipe it. No one knows. No one has to know anything. Just forget that I'm recording this. So everybody watching who watches this knows that I am potentially... Look, lucky I had the garlic because the vampires are going to come a-coming. Um, so... Janaya says that a good way to drain it is you put um, your salt zucchini and that that makes the um, the liquid um, that makes the liquid come out evaporate no it's not the right word nope. that that bit's got blood on it so I'm just gonna chuck it in the bin okay. Alright, so that's done. What I now need to do is cover the base of the dish with a third of the zucchini. I'm just going to get another one of this now and just get all the moisture out. Oh, oh seriously, look at that. That's gone through. Just just gonna go like this with it because, because the blood it's gone through the band-aid um, okay so I've got to do a th now I like to cook clean as I cook but I haven't done it this time so I don't want to keep running away from you guys so put a third of the zucchini in so I'm just as you can see I've just got a bowl like this and I'm just putting the zucchini slices down 
per se. Um, the salt's still on them. For those who are wondering why I'm doing this, wear gloves. It's a bit late now, Connie, it's a bit late now. <laughs> I've already sliced my finger. Um, okay, cover the base a third of the zucchini, then, then meat sauce, ricotta mixture and basil leaves. Repeat layers two times. We don't have basil leaves because Shania says I don't like them. So I've got the sauce. Um, I just gonna get a spoon. Okay, so it's really runny. I don't know if it's meant to be that runny. I don't know where to put this. But where should I put it? I'll just put it in the sink. Because I cooked, I don't have to do dishes tonight. So I can just chuck stuff everywhere. Because in our house, the person who cooks doesn't do the dishes. So usually Janae cooks, so usually I'll do the dishes. So she'll probably try and say, no, I always do the dishes, but she doesn't. I do the dishes. And she cooks. So I'm just um, lining it, per se. I don't want to use too much because I don't know how much, if I need more colour layers. It says layer two times. Does that mean once, twice, or is it this one another two? I reckon it's once and twice. Alright, so I've just layered that. It's just got laid. Right up. Okay, and now I have to put the ricotta stuff on. So I'm guessing I go half of the ricotta. Why would I have done a third of the zucchini? And then half and half. Oh no, because I add the final layer and top. Okay, so I go. You guys can't see what I'm doing right now, can you? Um, I'm just going to move that away. Janaya says I. I keep saying Janaya says because it's, it sounds like, you know, she's the mum of the house, but she kind of is because. I don't really have a clue when it comes to some stuff. Like some things I'm really good at. I'm really good at Candy Crush. And I'm really good at... I think I'm good at teaching. Um, what else am I really good at? I'm really good at um, Boggle. If anyone wants to get beaten at Boggle, come play a game with me. Things I'm not good at. I'm not good at cooking. I'm not good at doing makeup. I'm terrible at sewing. I was thinking of doing a... Um, a sewing video because I can't sew to save myself. Um, what else am I good at? I'm pretty good at running, long distance running. I'm terrible at squatting, like <laughs> not like doing a poo. Fine at that. I mean, like when you go to the gym and you have to do squats, I hate it. My um, body just doesn't like it at all. And every time my trainer says you have to squat, I get angry and sad. Okay, that's about half. So, I just, I just don't know if I'm doing this right. It just doesn't look right, does it? It doesn't look right, whatever. So I'm just going to do another layer of this now. I'm hoping there's no blood on any of these zucchinis. Look, and it's even, okay, it's even bled through. This has gone now gone and bled through to that. Okay. My second layer. Um, and now I go the meat again. Oh, I guess I just do all the meat. Oh no, I don't. It said. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, no, I only do, I do a second layer of meat. So I have to do another layer, so I don't want to use it all. I think I used too much in the last one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I've used too much in the last layer. Yeah, I used way too much. Whoops. I don't really think it matters because the way um, the way I see it, once it's in your mouth, it doesn't really matter what order it goes in your mouth, does it? It's all in your mouth anyway, so who cares what order it happens? As long as it's the same ingredients, that's my theory. Okay, so the mince there is done. Now I'll do the final layer of ricotta. Oh shit. Fizz, shivers. Shivers, my chambers. Oh, this is not working. Jenny Nguyen, whose recipe this is, how did you do this so well? Because I'm not doing this very well. 
You never know, guys. It could end up being an epic final product when you all want to eat my food that's probably got blood and cat fur in it. Okay. Alright, so there's that. And now I do cover fine layer of zucchini topped with sauce. This is my final layer of zucchini. I think I'm going to have too much zucchini. I think that one might have blood on it, so I'll leave that until the end in case I need some. Um, that's a thick zucchini. Jane doesn't like zucchini, so I don't know how well he's going to, going to go down with him, but he can deal. Jane doesn't like anything that's healthy. Okay, so my final layer of zucchinis. Now I'm doing my final um, meat. Just putting it on the top like that. As I said, I think I used too much meat earlier, so I should have more here, but I don't, but that's okay. Because like I also said, once it's in your mouth, who cares what order it ended up in there? It ended up in there as long as it's there and it's, you get to eat all the ingredients together. Okay. I'm still a bit stressed about Sarah saying that um, I was using too much garlic, to be completely honest. Alright, so I've got my final layer of that. Now what I have to do is sp sprinkle with parmesan cheese. So I said 20 grams. I don't know how much 20 grams is so I'm just going to use the rest of this. This is, been, this is like a healthy, um, a healthy lasagna that I'm now going to make unhealthy by covering it in cheese. Okay, so that's that done. Um, I have to put it in the oven now. Oh, I only have to bake for 20 minutes. So dinner should be ready by 7 o'clock. Um, so I'm just going to chuck that in the oven. Oh, Janaya, you turned the oven off. Babe? No, but I needed a preset. Do you know you use a sarcasm with me a lot? And I can't detect it it's sarcasm. I don't know how I'm meant to know it is. And I always get like, feel like she's angry at me when she reckons she's not. Okay, so let's go in the oven. And I'm just gonna bring this level up a bit here. Okay, so that's going to bake for 15 to 20, no, 20 25 minutes. And then I'll let, let, let rest for 5 to 10. Um, I will show you the finished product when it's done. And thanks for watching. And so far, it's still bleeding. See ya. Hey guys, so the dinner is ready. So I'm going to take it out and show you how it looked. Firstly, um, signs of a good cook. I've cleaned up all the mess. Um, has been cleaned up already that was made. So yeah, I'm going to take it out and let's see how uh, it ends up. So, just put it on um, on a towel. Because tea towel, because you don't want to get it straight on the um, hot thing. Alright, let's see. Uh, I think it's cooked. Yeah, it looks cooked. So this is, here we've got the final product. Um, the zucchini lasagna. That's how it looks. For those who are watching before. Um, yeah, that is the final product. So, I will cut that up. Put it on plates. Obviously, my connection is weak. You're weak. Sorry, I'm just trying to... There we go, that's a bit better, isn't it? Okay, so I'm going to put that on plates. Um, and we'll see how it is. I'll let you know. Looks like so. Two of us eating this tonight. We've got me and Jaden eating tonight. Jaden, stop! You have to hang the washing out. Go! You're not eating anything till washing's done. Yeah, I know. Go! Okay. You've been told. Been told. You've been told multiple times. Been told multiple times. Okay. So let's see how this goes. Um. Oh, for those who watched the last one, Janaya has assessed my finger, and I have cut the tip of it off. Um, if you missed that from the last video, it might be worth going to have a watch me cut the tip of my finger off. Alright, so this is going to be quite sloppy. Um, 
when you you when you make lasagna without pasta sheets, it does end up quite sloppy. Reflexes. No, he can't tomorrow night because we're busy Thursday and we're leaving early. Today's Monday. Oh. Okay. So, this is going to be quite hard to get out. Ooh. Jaden, do what you've been told to do. Sorry, Sorry about that, guys. Um. I'm not very good at dishing things up. Um, so this is one plate, but um, the thing is, you know, as I said, when you make um, lasagna, you're not actually using pasta sheets, it does end up quite sloppy, so you've got to expect that it ends up <laughs> not too neat to dish up. I'm sure that everyone else who would do it, though, would do it perfectly, but not when I cook. So this is dinner. Um, thank you for watching the my cooking tonight. I'm just so here's just the, the final product, and that, my friends, is zucchini lasagna. If you want to know how to make zucchini zucchini lasagna that I've just made, um, go back to my previous video. It does go for a while, so if you get bored, uh, and yeah. Uh, have a good night. See ya.